Welcome to the Original Gangsters Podcast. I'm your host, Scott Bernstein. Quick hitter edition of breaking news up in Canada. Two big headlines over the last couple of days here in the first week of September 2023. First, you had the arrests of two people um, related to one of the mob war murders. That's, uh, you know, the bodies that have been dropping in the great white north over the last uh, 12 to 15 years, um, 2020 murder of a Hamilton, Ontario mob associate, Giorgio Baresi, who was tied to the Musitanos and uh, that crew in Hamilton. Uh, he was murdered in the spring of 2020 in his driveway in the Stony Creek section of Hamilton. He had been arrested with Fat Pat Musitano uh, back in the 2000s or late 90s on a bookmaking case, but had kept his nose clean in terms of law enforcement um, in in the decade or so uh, if prior to his murder. Investigators believe the murder is tied to this epic biblical Canadian mob war that's been raging since the late 2000s. Two arrests this week uh, of Toronto residents that are charged with the murder of Baresi, um, a guy named Jamal Kemen, and another guy named Sorosa Moda, uh, both from Toronto, and are now facing first-degree homicide charges in relation to the Baresi murder. That came down this week. And then another body dropped. Uh, this one in the Dominican Republic, Giuseppe Lopez, who is a affiliate relative um, of uh, Serafino Oliverio, who goes by the alias Sergio Lopez and Oliverio is a kind of a sub uh, runs kind of a subunit of the Rizzuto crime family in Northern Montreal. Uh, a lot of real estate development companies, restaurants, bars. Uh, and according to RCMP intelligence report back when Vito Rizzuto was the godfather uh, in the nineties and two thousands, he used to use the Lopez crew or the Oliverio crew to launder uh, drug and gambling proceeds. But Serafino himself, uh, Oliverio, averted an assassination attempt a couple years ago, but it looks like either his brother or his cousin, uh, Giuseppe Lopez, uh, was caught in the crosshairs of this ongoing conflict and was killed in the Dominican Republic. Uh, there have been a number of murders that are now kind of, the body counts hit the triple digits at this point. A number of those murders have taken place outside the, the borders of Canada, um, Mexico, Italy, Sicily, now the Dominican Republic. Uh, so all it's been, Vito Rizzuto left Canada to go serve time in an American prison in 2009. That's when, you know, the, the roof caved in. Um, so it's been 14 years and bodies are still dropping, no end in sight. So an arrest in the Giorgio Baresi murder that is tied to the Ontario um, part of this war started in Montreal and then bled over into Ontario, first in Toronto and then to Hamilton where the Musitano brothers had been in charge for about 20 years, had taken power uh, by force by killing Johnny Papalia, Johnny Pops in 1997 as pretty you know, young men that went to prison, came out and uh, were the overlords there. But as the mob war in Montreal spread the Musitanos were you know caught in the middle of it because Vito Rizzuto had been one of their backers and co-signers. Uh, he died in 2013 of an aggressive form of cancer after coming back uh, to Canada after being in prison for, for, for three years. And it left the Musitanos exposed. Both the Big Ange and Fat Pat uh, were murdered between 2017 and 2020. Fat Pat, who was close to Giorgio Baresi, was murdered about three months, about four months after Baresi. Baresi died in, or was killed in March of, of 2020. And uh, Fat Pat uh, was killed in a Burlington, Ontario uh, strip mall in, in June of 2020. So we're keeping tabs on what's going on in Canada. Uh, the day-to-day -day warfare uh, is in the headlines and we're keeping up with it. Check back at either Gangster Report 
thegreatwhitenorth.com or check back at the original Game Street podcast for all the most breaking news on what's going up in the Great White North. For Benny Behind the Glass and for Jimmy, who will be back on a long-term, uh, long-form podcast later this week, I am Scott Bernstein, OG Pod out. Thank you.